Hey guys, welcome back to another video on the Discord series. So, um, today's video, I'm really gonna take a different approach on the video type of styles. Normally, um, we're focused on Discord commands and such, but um, I'm trying to make my YouTube channel um, a little bit friendly for web developers. So. I will start creating some web development um, content for you guys. So um, for this video, we we'll do we're gonna use Express and we're gonna set up the API for our Discord bot to check um, to post information about our guild size, uh, channel size, and our user size. So in today's video, I'll be showing you guys how to do that. Um, it shouldn't be that hard. So yeah, let's get started. So first, um, we need to install, let me do this. We need to install Express, so npm i express. All right. We just need Express. So for testing, we're gonna use local host as the um, normal host. Okay, so just head on events and find ready dot your ready event. If you are if you have a ready event in index.js, make sure to go to index.js. In my case, I already have a command handler, so I can use the command handler. All right, so. Um, you should see something like this kind of already and then you see the function uh, returns void so just I'm just gonna call it express section okay first thing you want to do is you want to require express with cost express you just require require express and then const app equals express express itself is already a function as you can see um, you can you can use the methods already so um, we're just gonna use app.get the, the main page and then rest and then we're just gonna say uh, rest let's see, 1200 and then the send um, landing page so it's the main page or we can just call this the main page Okay, and then we're gonna make another endpoint for the bot details. So app.get slash info rest res, and then rest of status to hundred and not send. And then here's the fun part. So we're gonna create an object um, for the bot. So let's just do const client details and equals to a object okay so the first one will be guilt and then we're gonna do client of guilt catch the size and then users client of guilt the catch the size channels and then client dot channels dot catch the size all right you're just gonna change this to users make sure it's an s in there and then we're just in is gonna send the object itself client details okay what's that done we're gonna just gonna listen it uh, listen to port app not listen okay we're gonna define port so equals 3000 3, or 3001 so if 300 is occupied we're going to use 3001 so i'm just going to do add no this in port this is the basic setup for express okay in the later videos i might use a react as our front end and express our as our back end or we can just use vanilla HTML files and JavaScript files to send data. Um, 
I'll decide it later on on the video. Uh, I'll make a voting session and you guys can vote on it. But for now, I'll be using Express to post the data of the um, Discord bot itself. So I'll be saving the files and then let's just run. As usual, we're just gonna run it with no dot. Okay. Then get your browser ready. I'm just gonna open a new tab. Okay. So YouTube Jobs have lo has logged on. So now we can visit local host three thousand. Okay, as you can see your main page. Uh, as you can uh, it's already specified over here, main page. And um, if we go to slash info, you can see that um, the guilds, I have two guilds, my bot is in two guilds and um, it has over 412 users and 47 channels. So yeah, um, this is the basic setup for our website project for our Discord bot. Um, if you'd like to see on how to create your own website with HTML, CSS, JavaScript, make sure you leave a like and leave a comment down below stating that um, your opinion on what you want to use. You want to use HTML or React on this project. So, um, one more thing. Um, if you need any help, feel free to join the support server or you, you want to join and talk with us. Um, if you like this video, make sure to leave a like, um, please subscribe, it really helps the channel out. Um, other than that, have a, have a nice day, see you again on the next video. Bye!